Michael, Brian Clay slowing things down a bit for our first ever blind date as Katie and Curtis enjoy pot the cream courtesy of Dina from Lulu's Tea Room, a delicious dessert. They're continuing to mingle, getting to know one another. Meanwhile, Dr. Bob is here and we're keeping, of course, with the love theme and the magic of love. Um, and Dr. Bob has some scientific evidence when it comes to love and the feelings that we feel. Happy Valentine's Day. Well, happy Valentine's to you, Beth. And there are different types of love that we all experience and that we all really know are present. The one is eros, that's the erotic type of love. There's philo, which is a sort of a brotherly love. And there's an agape love, and that's the total love that we have that's unconditional type love. All of those present each other with a little bit of stress. We don't have love, just doesn't come easy. Uh -huh. There are <laughs> chemicals that are released by the body when we're involved with love, and they would be dopamine, Dopamine releases chemicals that make our heart rate go faster and make our heart leap with joy when uh, we fall in love. Uh, there's also serotonin. There's oxytocin, one that comes with very emotional, dramatic love making. There are chemicals that occur. So there are different types and there are different chemicals. There are different things that happen to keep love continuing for a long time period of time. And so although scientists have not completely taken over the understanding of love, they're getting better and better and we know more and more about what happens during love. Uh, for instance, there is storge love, which parents have for their child and we know that there's nothing more precious and more beautiful and more loving than looking at a child in a cradle, a child that's sitting there uh, cooing or expressing love mm -hmm. uh, children as they're growing up do different things every day and that's a type of parent love whereas there's a flirtatious love that's where you look at somebody saying you look awfully cute today Jack. <laughs> you know Thanks. that's a flirtatious hey. type of love <laughs> that's right <wow. That's, laughs> it is present you know as everybody interacts with you so love is a wonderful thing to experience it's a wonderful thing to enjoy it's a wonderful thing to partake in your life and it's very very important in relationships with yeah. each other and the chemicals that back it up are there to help you and me as we handle the stress yes. of love helps us all balance it out we're feeling a little feisty today if you can't tell now dr bob we appreciate it you're an example for all of us how long have you been married been married 56 almost 57 years how about that month. everybody dr yeah. love uh, is what we should call you <laughs> Congratulations and thank you. And thank you. It's been it's always great being here on Live at Five at Four and expressing love with each other. Well, we love you. Thank you, Dr. Bob. We appreciate it.